<laughs> Alright guys, get hype for this. You see this? 2014 Flashback Entertainment. We are coming at you big with Mario and the Yoshi Island Mystery. This game, I kid you not, you cannot get anywhere else. Even if you were to find it, it wouldn't be in cartridge format, and it more than likely would be in Portuguese. Which, that's just weird. So, get hyped for this. This is, this is awesome sauce here. We're gonna go Mario B. Let's get this started. Finally get to Yoshi Island. I heard that some precious island items were stolen. Let's find out who took them. Right? The princess didn't get kidnapped. I mean, that's enough to be interested in this game anyway. Kobo Tagoda. Alright, you ready? Okay. As you can see, this game is completely different than Mario World. You can wall jump. I mean, come on. Oh, snap, what was it looking? Oh jeez. Did you guys see that? That was crazy. Alright, definitely want to get a good amount of the game on here if I can, but like I said, this game is only available at Flashback. This is a game that we tirelessly work through to bring to you that nobody else is going to be able to bring to you. It is available on the store right now. I just checked before I started making the video. And yes, we have Yoshi because we're awesome like that. Oh man. Yeah. Uh, and I've played through a decent amount of this. Oh man, a moon. We gotta get it. Three up! engrossed in the game. I just can't stop. <laughs> but I, I gotta tell you, I was pretty excited when Flashback hit me up with a message and let me know this would be coming my way, because I've been hearing about this game for a long time. I'm very excited that it's finally ready for me to show off here. Oh, oh. Charge and Chuck in full swing. If you're a fan of Charge and Chuck, this is the game for you. I think there's more Chucks in this game than... I don't even know what to even reference. Uh... And for you fans of challenging games out there, this definitely will fit the bill. I know this doesn't look too challenging by any means, and it really isn't for... For most Mario players, but I've gotten to like the second world on this game, and it gets tough. It, it definitely gets more difficult as you progress. And I was gonna bring up another thing to you guys that just happened today. I'm talking with my buddy over at Gamer Geek Nation. Guy it goes by the name of DVR. I'm sure you've seen these guys. They're everywhere. They're huge. 20,000 plus likes on Facebook. Big on Twitter. Just opened a new website. Get over there. Get onto their forums. Gamer Geek Nation. Come say hi. I'm all over that forum. Well, the big news is they're going to be one of our exclusive providers of reviews, let's plays, and just overall general flashbackness they're gonna hook it up they're they're just a it's a gaming culture website where you, you buy sell and trade they, they got a lot of that going on a lot of you know the forums and news and videos they kind of do what i do 
they're just a big website and uh, we've kind of hooked up for a mutually beneficial partnership I think so look forward to that kind of stuff soon I'll put a link in the description to their website um, and you, you might ask yourself you know yeah you know daddy P you do the video reviews for the games and stuff you know why would you give that up well not necessarily giving it up I mean it's always good to see these kind of things from a different perspective I'm still gonna do my weekly video you're still gonna hear from me all the time I'm still gonna do live streaming all that good stuff I'm not going anywhere it's just gonna be a different perspective on something they're gonna do one game a month it sounds like um, probably have some more information available soon uh, they have they do a like a, a podcast type thing twice a month called retrocast and I'm gonna go on and uh, talk about some more of this stuff, get together with them, see what's going on. But look forward to that kind of stuff in the future. It's gonna, it's coming. It's it's good stuff. It's a big step for us in the, the reproduction world. You know, let's keep this going here as I just sit on the map and blather around. You guys want to see this awesome game. So you get a lot of varying things in this game. You have a lot of... Look at this. I got Yoshi. Bye, Yoshi. A lot of this kind of stuff where, you know, there's varying... I didn't even know you could do that. Huh. That's awesome. Look at that, you learn something new every day. Oh, we're good, we're good. Let's see if I can get to something a little, a little more challenging here. Oh. Alright, let's go. Ooh. Oh, come on. Look at baby Mario. That's awesome. But yeah, I'm telling you, I got I got home at you know 9.30 tonight, and generally when I get home that late, I'm not too excited about, you know, starting a three-hour project of making, editing, and publishing a video, but as soon as I got this game, I was in. <laughs> To be honest, would have did it Tuesday night, but I didn't get it till yesterday. Let's see if we can finish a level here. Oh, all right. <laughs> so I mean, what else can we talk about? AGDQ. I mean, how huge for. The gaming community. Uh, if you're not familiar with it, AGDQ is awesome games done quick that they just finished up a few days ago. It was a big charity live stream that they broadcast on Twitch. It was just speedruns and speedruns and speedruns uh, all day long, every day. They actually ended up raising over a million dollars in a week's time for uh, the Prevent Cancer Foundation, which is huge. I mean, especially for me in my life. You know, I lost my mom in 07 to cancer, ovarian cancer. Good God, stay on the tree, dude. Uh, and even as we speak, my dad, you know, is going through a lot. We just had surgery, get his esophagus removed. And uh, he's back home. He's he's good. For anybody that's wondering, no worries there. But I mean, it's a it's a great cause to be a part of. And I'm just really happy that we could show as gamers that you know we're not just we're not the stereotypical BS that gets thrown around about us in the media. Dude, where do I go? This way. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I mean, it was crazy. Some of the best runs you'll ever see on there. Uh, I posted a link on my Facebook to all the runs. They're going to start showing up on YouTube, so uh, check that out. It's Speed Demos Archives that does all that stuff. Well, like, you know me, I'm Super Metroid guy. For anybody that watches my live streams, and uh, we got to see four of the best players out there right now do a race which was insane it's rare to see something that 
anywhere in the world really that not only lives up to the hype but far surpasses it. I mean, it was insane. I never thought I'd watch anything like that. We're going to the lake. So make sure you tell me in the comments, guys, what you think of these games. I mean, especially this one. This, this one means a lot to me. What you think of this one? Oh, man. I mean, look at this. This is... You know, there's no level design like this in the regular Marios. I almost forgot how to grab right there. That would have been funny. Oh, man. Yeah, I was, I was just going to say right there that Getting a message. My buddy Dennis is trying to do a low percent speed runs. Oh, oh look at the baby Mario buck tooth. That's about 12 minutes there. Let's give this one more try. I'm trying to think if there's anything else I want to talk about. Uh. I mean, not really. I think I covered everything. Flashback websites in full swing. Everything's up and running. Come on over, sign up, place an order. Oh god. Wow, I'm bad. <laughs> trying to think anything else I got as I give this one more shot oh thank you I wanted that I wanted it really bad how do they do that fly fast strat seeing all the speed runs I don't know how that works but yeah the website's all up and going I'm really happy about that because you know eBay sucks <laughs> yeah to finish that out ebay's terrible there's i've commented on this in my videos before but there's there's certain should we say jerk bags that are very intimidated by the awesomeness that we bring to the table you know there's companies that do the same thing we do guys and like anything else when you have two companies trying to do the same thing of course, the one that isn't as good is going to be, you know, how you say bitter, <laughs> not very nice about it, you know, that kind of thing like that. You know, our auctions get reported on, uh, our PayPal, <clears throat> PayPal got shut down, you know, and, and we're not selling anything different than they are. You know, it's, it's, it's not like we're going out of our way to have illegal games or something like that. You know, it's nothing crazy, but... It's fine. I mean, just remember, when you order from us, your game's going to show up really fast in extraordinarily good condition. You know, it's not going to be a crappy donor cart painted over, not taken care of with a bad label, and it's going to take six, seven weeks to get your game. And you're going to pay more for it. I mean, if it was that easy, <laughs> you know, what are you going to do? But, you know, that's that's the service that we provide. We get, we're going to get you these games, and we're going to get them to you fast. So this one here, Mario and the o Yoshi Island Mystery. Get on it. I know we didn't see that much of it, but that's fine. It's 
it's a new Mario World game that you'll never see anywhere else. What more do I got to tell you? <laughs> On that note, this is Daddy P, not 3D, getting hyped. Stay tuned in the future. Big stuff incoming. Later, peeps.